All right, we are going to show you how to remove a valve spring and valve keeper from a Briggs and Stratton three and a half horsepower uh, motor, four stroke motor using nothing more than a flat bladed screwdriver in probably under a second. Okay, a couple of things real quick. We have here the other valve, I already took this one out. The way the valve keeper works on these is you have a large hole and a small hole slotted together. The large hole fits over the end of the valve and when you slide it sideways, it locks on. So what we're gonna do is we're going to push the valve keeper off and the spring is gonna pop that right off for us. What we need to do is find this little dent on our valve keeper and that, that dent, we need to spin it using our screwdriver until it's pointing towards the center. I think I've got it there already. Yeah, so my dent is already there. We can use the screwdriver to, to move it around a little if we need to. And I'm going to pry up on this corner, and then while it's pried up, I'm going to slide it over with my screwdriver. So let's see if we can get in there a little closer and show you how this is done. Pry up and push over. <laughs> 